Ever since the Denver Broncos hired Vic Fangio, they have been looking for their hybrid edge cover defender that he likes to have as part of his defense. In the 2019 NFL Draft, they took a shot on Justin Hollins to be that piece. Justin Hollins just turned 24 years old in January of this year, so there is still plenty of youth left to develop. He attended college at the University of Oregon, where he put together a really solid career. During his time at Oregon, Hollins picked up only 14 sacks, but also picked up two interceptions and eight passes defended, as he showed that hybrid ability at the college level. There was a concern about his ability to consistently set the edge against the run at the NFL level that there was there on college tape that hurt his overall draft stop. With the 156th overall pick, the Denver Broncos went and picked up Hollins largely because of the versatility he can add to their edge and linebacker core with his overall ability. Denver was quick to start getting him picking up the role they wanted him to have for the 2019 season. Almost immediately, they made it clear he was to pick up the edge, but also the off-ball stuff for the defense. During the off-season programs, he looked like he was picking it up pretty well and showed a lot of flashes of that versatile ability during the preseason, but that was the preseason. Justin Hollins got a chance for the Broncos in a Week 4 matchup against the Jacksonville Jaguars to play in that hybrid role and he really struggled in coverage. It was obvious he was just a rookie. After that, his time out there on defense came mostly on the edge where he showed multiple flashes, but Denver kept working with him on picking up that off-ball stuff as well. Now for the 2020 season, it is on him to make the most of it and go show how much he has developed. There isn't a lot invested in him, so if he doesn't answer those questions, his time in Denver may be over. For Mile High Huddle and Sports Illustrated, I'm Eric Trickle.